What's going on my Chuckers fans? I have yet another video for you guys to do. Today, uh, or this time it's metal version, rock version. We yeah, have You yeah, Kiss the boy. Bride, Zachary Dutaklar. Yep. I listened to this band once. Uh, it was cool. It was good. Um, they released a new song sometime in the last month, I believe. And so... Heck yeah, dude. Yeah. I think this is going to be more so uh, Evans. We'll see. Um, what is it called? Your side of the... My forte. My uh, specialty. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There yeah. We go. So, uh, yeah, we got a music video. You may so. kiss the bride. Let's go. Here we go. English or no? No. Oh. Right. I don't think so. English title, you may kiss the bride. Is it, you know? That's the band name. The title was that. Oh, that's their name? That you may kiss the bride? Oh. Heck yeah. Okay. All right, I'll shut up. Yeah, shut up. This is yeah, right up the alley, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, dude. Mm. Mm -hmm. Nice cream. Mmm. This is what you really enjoy. Mmm. Okay, yeah, bro, relax. Hold on now. Yeah. I think they call themselves post-hardcore. Sure. You know what that is? Yep. Beautiful. I love his shirt, dude. It's just like... <laughs> <laughs> it's got this like, you know, metal, dark, heavy vibe and he's just wearing some... Squidward shirt or whatever Not it is. Squidward. Patrick yeah. Star from Is that what it is? But you wish you had long hair right now. Yeah, okay, I do. Me too. I can't. <laughs> Their neck's gonna hurt tomorrow. I promise you that. Yeah. Ooh. 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 Right down. Car is nice too. Ooh. Okay, okay. Damn, bro. Okay, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta. You gotta, you gotta hear that transition one I more gotta, time. I gotta go you? back. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put my second earbud in because I want to listen to that. Let's do it. This is what I like. And this is what you like. I thought that was going to be a drop. No, no, I didn't. You know that was going to happen? Double time. Uh huh. Mm. Mm. 
You may kiss the bride. I'm gonna let you go first. We'll talk about that for another hour. I know you could. Let's keep it short, though. Yeah. That's probably the closest to American metal that I listen to. That is an American. It, right. That's the that is the that is the closest Turkish song metal song that I've heard to American metal that I listen to. And if their album, their whole album, did they put out an album or something? we don't know yet? I don't know. I, think I don't know just anything about now. them. If they put out an album that sounds anything remotely to that, I would listen to it personally often. That was... <sighs> I'm not even trying to be, you know, a fanboy or, you know. I mean, you've never listened and this is like your first time impression. I'm not even trying to be like like above and beyond. That was close to a perfect metal song. To me. Okay. It had, it had every aspect for me. I love clean vocals. I love clean male vocals that are on the higher end of the spectrum of, you know, tone there on the higher octave of, of, of scales when they're singing and then just just they had the whole thing, the breakdown was unreal. It was we had to pause mm -hmm. and go back and listen to it again. That's how good it was to have to go back and listen to it again because you didn't believe it the first time you heard it. So you had to go rewind it and listen to it again. You just want to hear it again. Like, you want to hear that transition. Yeah. But you also are like, that was too good. It wasn't real. Let me go listen to it again. Holy cow. It was real, and it was that good. I would listen to that every day. Okay. Every day. And your score? Even though I, even though I didn't know a single word they were saying. Right. That had no influence influence on me at all. The music it could have like the worst lyrics ever and whatnot. Yeah, and they could. Yeah, they could be singing about just killing babies, and I I wouldn't even know what they're saying. But the music, the music was great. Okay, I don't I don't like killing babies. I wouldn't be cool. But I'm just saying, the music. I don't know what they're saying. Unless the baby's so, annoying. No, just absolutely kidding. not. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Edit that out. The musicality of that song was just... It was great. I loved it. I can't give it a 10, because I'm not... I will never give anything a 10. Ever, I, ever, I, ever, never. ever. I'm not going to give anything a 10. It's... it's unless... Okay. As, so. Unless it's... Unless I hear a song that I don't want to hear any other song ever again, then that will get the 10. Okay, so this out of 9.9... 9. 9. Nine point six. So you rate it nine point six out of nine. Nine point six out of ten. Well, you can't if ten doesn't exist for you. No, so. I mean ten exists. I just ten exists. I haven't heard the perfect song. Um, nine point six. I don't love it to the extent that you do, but I did thoroughly enjoy that. That was very enjoyable to listen to. Um, it, as some of you probably know, I love the more heavier, darker uh, metal, and this is more. How do I like postmodern pop? Uh, I don't. Yeah, you can call it pop. Uh, nothing wrong with pop. It's just no. not my uh, kind of. I would say post. Did you say postmodern was the thing? That I think they described them. If I recall it correctly, I think I read something about them being called uh, post-hardcore. Post hardcore, yeah, that that makes sense. So, um, but like overall, I I enjoyed it. I liked it. Like the clean vocals, I I love the screams and the uh, the throatiness of, of the voice, but like more so than the clean vocals. And so, to me, this is like a eight and a half. I think would be my I I loved like the breakdowns as well. 
um, it, it wasn't like the same rhythm it wasn't the same thing throughout the whole song mm-hmm. there was um, changes within the song and uh, wasn't boring very fun to listen to and so yeah and I'll say too like that score like the breakdowns the rhythms and the things that they do in it isn't like the most technical crazy stuff but the song was clean everything about it was so fluid and clean and so I'll give it such a high score because what I mean by that is when we're done with the video this video I'm gonna go listen to that song again I guarantee it. And I'm probably going to go tell my brother, who also doesn't understand a single word they're saying, dude, you got to listen to this video. I'll send him the link to this video. And and I want him to go listen to it because it was that good. When you can recommend a song, it's a good song. And I I would recommend that song even to my American friends who won't know what they're saying, but they but they want to hear that style of music because that's a that was good it I was good some, I'm assuming you enjoyed the song then. it was good to me I liked it a lot alright well that's the first video next up we have Alton Alton Goon Yuje Da Bashenda Bashenda a lot to live up to we, I, we <laughs> listened to this group before I just don't remember the song name I think they were on K8 KEXP, the oh, radio okay. station. Uh-huh. Do you remember? Yes, I do. Um, but um, yeah, are they the one? Yeah, okay. I don't remember. I well, think I just even listen to it right now. I think I remember them. They were in like a parking garage or something. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Dude had a guitar or something like that. Wow, well, like that guy. Knows yeah, that. dude. <laughs> Funky. Gives me 70s. There's um, a key flute right there. 70s vibe. Totally, dude. A lot of synth. And always with the bass. I remember the last one we watched them, they had a sweet bass line, too. Banana. Watermelon, dude. <laughs> Those are my favorite shots right there. Oh, I'm just standing. Yeah. There. Turning their head. Yeah. Like how you dance. <laughs> he gave one of these. <laughs> Needs more cowbell. Is this an infomercial or something? Eat your vegetable or your fruits. Yeah, dude. No, no. <laughs> cowbell. Needs more cowbell. I got a dude. prescription. There's more. There's a lot more, dude. Dude, we got a keyboard solo, dude. Yeah. Oh, I wanted to say that. <laughs> Wait. Let me see. The, this guy and this guy are like the 
The, them standing there is just funny. I don't know. Look at this guy's eyeballs, though. It's true. This guy, this, so, this guy doesn't want to be here. No. He, <laughs> yeah, right. he was forced into this. <laughs> he was like, mm-mm. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. It's not based up. What do you think about her voice? I mean, standard voice? Standard voice? She's, she's on tune? She's on tone? That's good. I would hope so. I like this part. It's a little like jumpy. Thoroughly enjoying it, the guy in the back. <laughs> this guy here. Like, yeah. <laughs> He's like, hell yeah, dude. We're dancing. I'm in a video, bro. I'm not even in the band. I'm in a video. <laughs> I'm just an extra. <laughs> I'm just in a video, dude. Oh no! What did I press? Nothing. That was it. Oh man. Was you want to go first, or do you want to go ahead, first? bro? Okay, so I'm just gonna say I loved it, in the sense of entertainment um from the music video to the uh just the creativity the the shots the it it put me in the mood it just it was catchy and put me like it wanted me to like we were having fun watching i was grooving you know i was like i was having having a really good time and although this genre of music isn't my favorite i'm gonna give this like a nine out of ten because I think it was just well overall, well balanced. I don't know, piece of art, musically, uh, in terms of videography. Just everything was just. It had to me. It had like humor. It had, you know, this like catchy tune. The 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 voice was like tender and like smooth and like. I could probably go on and on, but definitely like. Like I said, even though it's not my type of music, I'm going to give this 9 out of 10 because uh, just extremely well done piece of art, I guess you could say. I agree with everything you said. I'll give it an 8 just because I gave the last one a 9.2. It was a 9.6? Yeah. A 9.6. Uh, 8. It was a great score. 8 is... For it, you, for, yeah. For me, is. 8 is a great score. Loved it. Just like you're saying, it was funny... I enjoyed every second of watching that video because it gave me a, it gave us a lot of material to talk about. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of things to talk about, a lot of things to laugh about. The music wasn't bad; it was great. The music was the music was great. Just you know, the the, the rhythm it was kind of just jivey and groovy, and uh, yeah, I thought it was absolutely a lot of fun. I'll put it in a. You know, I'll put it in the fun category. For me too, it wasn't. It's not a category of music that I'm gonna put in in my everyday playlist. Sure. But, but like, if you hear I'm, it, I'm like, listening to it. And I was listening to it now, and it was it was great. I thought it was fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. So like, it's like, you won't necessarily put it on your playlist, but like, if you hear it out wherever, I'm I'm you're listening gonna, to you're the whole gonna, thing. You're jamming to it. You're yeah, gonna, dude. You're like, oh yeah. I'm in a freaking elevator or I'm at a store in the mall and I'm just (laughs) yeah dude (laughs) I'm getting after it alright well that's uh, that's the that's it for that was great for for this video for these two songs that deserves thumbs up and they both do and we have really good selection of songs subscribes and all that stuff that was a this is a yeah hope you guys enjoyed it lovely Uh, keep commenting uh suggestions comments and uh, i try to read them all so uh for now i will see you all in the next one love you